Okay, question two. What is the fraction midway between 7 over 9 and 8 over 9? So when they say midway, it means halfway in between. Okay, right in the middle between 7, 9 and 8 over 9. Okay, so I know some of you are a little bit confused for this because you're wondering, eh, there's nothing between 7 and 8. All right, so there's actually a way to solve this. So typically what we do is we draw a number line first. And the fraction is midway. We put in the middle, just draw a line in the middle. 7, 9, 8, 9, we will put it at the two extreme ends. So take note, a number line when you arrange the numbers has to be in increasing order when you read from left to right. Okay, the, so the smaller fraction place it on the left, bigger fraction place it on the right hand side. Okay, so what we're going to do next is what we we can actually go on to make the two denominators into a bigger value. And to do that, that means you can multiply 9 by 2. You can multiply 2 to each of the two fractions. Of course, both numerator and denominator. Okay, so when you multiply 2 and 2 to this, this turns to 14 over 18. Whereas 8 over 9, when you change it, to times when you times 2 to 8, right? It becomes 16 over 18. So you should realize that between 14 over 18 and 16 over 18, there is a fraction right in between them. And that would be 15 over 18. Okay, so the reason why there is a fraction midway between you know these two fractions, always like between 7 and 8, is because the whole number line can be further broken up into smaller parts. Alright, so there can be many fractions that exist in between them. Right, so 15 over 18, let's proceed to simplify the answer. Divide by 3 for both, it will give you 5 over 6. Okay, so I'll move on to the next question.